two rooms, not gonna work. So when you go here to break the force, you use your legs to make him post. So look, see how I breathe him. I control the back of the neck, just like no gi. Trap one arm, control the back of the neck. When he moves back, my thumb gives the grip to the hand. Okay, so it's, it's, it's very important. If you miss this window here, it's loose. So when you're here, this hand, already with the thumb behind, when you go back, look, it's there, tight. Now, if I don't, if I keep my guard closed like this, he can get the arm out of there, put his elbow out, look, see? So I need to have something behind here. So when I have this grip, foot on the hip, leg tight, that makes a big difference now. He cannot pull the arm out anymore. So I'm gonna go right here and get this grip, palm down, right on the shoulder, okay? Now look, I'm gonna get my elbow on his chest, but if I don't turn, I cannot even touch my elbow on his chest. I gotta turn, look, to get my elbow on his chest. See? So we trap one arm, get the lapel. If you don't have a deep, Snap and grab it. Place the foot right there, tie, grab right here. Don't turn, look, and grab. You can't do anything, you're already on the limit of your turn. You're already gonna mainly use your arms. I need you to get the grip and then turn your hips, okay? So again, I'm here, trap, or right here, snap at the grip, control, put the hip, foot on the hip, then go right here. Now, I'm gonna turn, look. Push in the opposite direction. Calf stay tight, leg stay tight, and the elbow goes, look, only with this grip. Elbow goes like an uppercut on his, the middle of his chest. If you open up here, it's not, there is no pressure. <coughs> this grip here is kinda weird. You gotta go under here, like you're gonna lift him up with your elbow, okay? Here. Look. Now, this is 80% of the choke, this grip here that's trapping. Okay? I mean, it's right here. It's more, there's more grip on this grip here than this. This is only to stop the, the choke. Look, one, two, and I'll go down. And I'll pull this this way. When we go here, sometimes, look, it's so close to me that I can barely put my foot there. So what I do to create that space in everything from the guard, if you have to put the foot here, use this technique. Look, kick it down, straight on my leg, turn my foot so my hip comes off. Now, right there. So look, even if the guy is real tight, stay tight, stay tight. Look, like this, how am I gonna put my foot there? Look, stay tight, look. You see, he's tight. My foot's there. See? So it, that's a very good little thing that you can, you can work on. You go right here, then you can put the foot, you go turn, get the hips over his thigh, and then place your foot there. Then you're already almost in the position to do your choke, okay? So get a little closer and ask your partner to do this move. He's gonna have to use this move, otherwise I can't. See, I get close a little bit. Look, look at that. He's closed here. I can't step it. So I'm gonna step down, stretch, and turn. Opposite direction of my hook. My foot goes in, okay? Then look, pressure on, all right?